Hi everybody and welcome to Ashton's World. Ashton's World and today we are going to Woven. Not Woven on bikes but we're going to Woven Safari Park. We're going to see if we can find yeah. all the animals. What yeah. are you looking forward to seeing Ashton? The elephants. The elephants? What else is there? Tigers. Tigers? Lions? Lions. What about the monkeys? Yes. Yeah. We've got the wife's car so we've got the glass roof so we can see the monkeys if they climb all over the car. Yeah. Uh, we're now on our way so Let's see what we can find today, hey? Yeah. Woo woo! Oh, hello, <laughs> guys. <laughs> guys, are you white guys? <laughs> are you white guys? No, all right. <laughs> <laughs> why did you? Why did the guys slid like? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> guys, oh. are you okay? Oh, okay. Right, let's get there, shall we? So we're in the gate, uh, really good control because of the virus and everything, so uh, they've given us a free guide that Justin's now having a look at. Uh, and then we've got some free hand sanitizer as well to make sure that uh, we're staying safe. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is, what are we going to do Ash? Go to the elephants. Go to the elephants and we can drive around on the road safari and see what we can find. Here we go, we've got our Asian elephant. Few more back there as well. Having a bit of a graze in the morning. We've got two rhinos. Two rhinos? At least they're gonna bump our car. Oh, I hope he's not gonna bump our car. That wouldn't be very good, would it? Which one is my friend? I don't know. They could both be your friends. No, I only have one friend. <laughs> The lion gate. Oh god. We got into the lion cage. Here we go, look at the big lion on the gate. Oh. oh Over god. the bumps. Oh god. Here we are, so here's one of the four mule tigers at Woburn. Not been let out of his paddock this morning, he's just having a little walk around at the minute. Mm. He wants to get out. Yeah, he might want to get out. Okay, so we have fact number one on the Amur tiger. So the Amur tiger, thank you to our little guidebook, is the largest of all of the cat species. So these are the biggest cats you will ever find. How cool is that? Fact number two, there's another one here. A tiger's footprint is known as a pug mark. A pug mark. That's funny, isn't it? Ah, oh, here's fact number three. We've got our third fact for mummy. Along with jaguars, tigers are one of the few species of cats that enjoy spending time in the water. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Well, maybe if it gets a little warmer today, we might see them in the water if they're out, hey? Wouldn't that be cool? Right, so what are we gonna go look for next? <laughs> oh, there's one under the tree. Can you see him? Okay, so I have another fact here. I'm not sure if you can see it very well here because we can't zoom in. And this is not a fact that's in the book. This is one that I've learned over the years of watching lots of documentaries and stuff on TV. But if you look at the back of his ears, can you see there's two little white marks? Yeah. Look, see? See, look? Yeah. 
You've got little white marks on the back I of their them. ears. Yeah, do you know why he has eyes on the back of his, uh, white marks on the back of his ears? I don't know. Well, they have white marks on the back of their ears because when they're out in the wild, it makes other lions and tigers think that it's looking at them. And if it's looking directly at them, he's not going to attack them. So there are four facts today on the Amur tigers. How cool, hey? Look at him sat there all proud. Is he the king? He might be the king. He's a very big cat, isn't he? So we can see three lions up there. Is that four? There's four lions up there. Where's the daddy? I'm not sure where the daddy is. There's four lions sat up there. And then we've got another couple here, look. As we get a little bit further. He's looking at us, isn't he? How many have we got here? One, two, three, four lions. All laid out sunbathing. Enjoying the nice warm sun. Okay, so we've got some free Roman Rothschild giraffes. Having a nice chew on the tree this morning. Look at them, look at them all. There's loads Hello, of them. Hello, giraffe. Hi, giraffes. <laughs> Meerkat! Hello! He's just chilling on his rock club. Oh, look at him standing up! <laughs> There's a mongoose. Oh mate! One of the first things you notice is not a lot of people here, which is really good considering there's a virus on and things like that. So the COVID controls they've got in place is awesome, so really good. Sit in that seat. They are new, not for much longer. <laughs> are you going to steer? Are you? Yeah. I've got to do all the hard work. Yeah. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Lovely. Thank you. We go this way. <laughs> Here he is. <laughs> see the very bottom. Oh, I saw this beak. Hello. 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 He's saying hello. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> He's at the bottom. <laughs> He's looking at you, isn't he? <laughs> Hold still, steady.
<laughs> what are you filming? So we can talk to the guy. What are you going to tell him? We're eating our dinner. This is mine actually. You don't have lots on my plate, do I, Daddy? I have this. You didn't want a roll, that's why. I don't want a roll. I got this though and that. Got Daddy here, say hello. Hello. And you can see um, we're in the car eating our dinner. So, we'll see you in a bit. Right, where are we going then, Ash? We're going to the turtle paddock. Yeah. No, tortoise paddock. To the tortoise paddock. Yeah. Z? Okay, so we have Southern White Rhino and we're going to do three facts on the rhino, aren't we? So one fact is that a rhino's poo is called midden. Yeah. Ugh, it's a strange fact, isn't it? Midden. And they use their poo to tell each other, or like between rhinos, a lot about each other because every rhino's midden smells differently. A group of rhinos, do you know what a group of rhinos is called? No, very close. Herd is like cows, isn't it? You get a herd of cows. But a herd of rhino is called a crash. It's a strange thing to call it, isn't it? But it was a good idea on a herd, but it is called a crash. And our last fact about the white rhino is that it's the second largest land mammal on Earth after the elephant. The second largest mammal after the elephant. How cool is that? Yay! <laughs> Having a good munch, aren't they? <laughs> yeah, let do. Ow. And there's two more rhino over there as well. Look. Yeah. Oh, look, he's coming into the road. <laughs> Here he comes, look. <laughs> Come on, there, mate. What there, mate? You having a good day? <laughs> Here they come! Oh. <laughs> wow! He's gonna get in someone's car if he's not careful. <laughs> Here he comes! Hello, mate! Huh, huh. Oh, buddy! <laughs> I need to get back. <laughs> Look at him! Daddy! He's like a baby. <laughs> oh, the rhino's in the road! The elephants. But if we look in front, there's a rhino in the road. <laughs> oh, no! them cool. So elephants throw dirt on themselves to keep themselves cool. That was a fact. And that's what these elephants are doing now. Look, oh he threw it all over his head. Mm. Way. Is he gonna oh no he's heading for the 
Oh, he's saying shut our window. No, our window's shut. Oh, no, he's going Comes gonna... a lovely Amir Tiger, look. Look at him. Yeah, maybe it's a uh, thing Wow, look at that. Wow. He's on the road. <laughs> he's on the road, isn't he? Mm. They shouldn't go on the road. Oh. Was he found? Don't know. Something. Wow, that's lovely, isn't it? Mm. Now there's a black bear. Can we do that? <laughs> You can do that. Wave at him, see if he waves back. No, he's just putting his tongue out at you, isn't he? Lioness. See, look how well camouflaged it is into that grass by that tree. Yeah. Imagine if you were in the wild. There. And that was there, you wouldn't see it, would you? Oh, and there's another one coming round now as well. Does tigers like to climb? Tigers do like to climb. Look at this, the lioness. Lions do like to play them. Pull them on that rope, look. Why? Why are they? Because there's something they can play with. Lioness. There's a ball there's on the end of it. Look, one's hanging on the ball. Like I think they like climbing. It looks like they like climbing. But look, there's the little lion cubs yeah. sitting on top of the tree. Top of the tree stumps. Yeah. There they are. What? Lion babies? The little lion cubs on top of the tree with their mummy underneath, look. Oh yeah. How cute. Okay, so we've got our Rothschild giraffes here and we're going to do facts on these before they cross the road into their little pen. So, the dark spots on a giraffe's coat contains clusters of large sweat glands and small blood vessels. This allows the giraffe to radiate heat so they can spend longer feeding and less time having to worry about shade. So it's how they keep cool, that's pretty good. A giraffe's heart produces the highest blood pressure of any animal on the planet. That's pretty amazing as well. Yeah. It says here as well, thank you to our little guidebook, that uh, giraffe, female giraffes form long-term bonds with sisters and daughters that can last for many years. Now, good facts, aren't they? Yeah. When I was young, someone used to tell me that if a giraffe was to have a cup of tea because of its long neck, it'd be cold by the time it reached its belly. Oh, here they go, look. <laughs> I don't think he's interested. Here he comes. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, mate. Hello, mate. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> go, go, go. He's just sat there, isn't he? Are we going to drive? Well, we can't drive too far because there's a car in front of us. Oh, whoa. He's having a good scratch. <laughs> Is he going to jump? Oh. Get some more. They're running between the cars. Look at these bottoms. What are they doing? Oh, they're cuddling. <laughs> they're cuddling. They're doing something on the roof. Oh, they're picking nits off each other. Oh. There's more. <laughs> There's two on our car. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Look at them. Um... They're cuddling. They're cuddling. They're picking nits off each other. And they're cuddling. 
Oh my god, we're going. You've got to drive. Hopefully they jump off in a minute. Yeah. They're just happily picking nits. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, mate. Hello, mate. What are you doing? Oh, God. <laughs> Last time, one been sick enough. Oh, there's another one. There's one of the food. Ah! One. I hope. Oh. Oh. Thank God. Oh God. I hope he jumps off. No, he's jumped off. Thank God. <laughs> they didn't want to go out. How was that? They didn't want to go. How cool was that? Was that what you wanted? Yeah. Was that mission accomplished? Yeah. The second road route didn't disappoint, did it? So that was Woburn Safari Park. I've had a good day, have you had a good day? Yeah, it's been a great day, hasn't it? We've seen lots of animals, we've learned lots of animal facts, uh, and now the rain has caught up with us, so we can't keep walking around. Uh, we'll have to come again another time, hey? Yeah, okay, say bye.